It worked. I did it. Johnny, Hanako kept her word. Looking at you now reminds me of the moment we met. I still see that same small time look, little thief with his head in the clouds. Haven't changed a bit. Got it all wrong. No way that V would have ever made it this far. Just wouldn't have survived. I had to grow stronger. And I did. Maybe. But that V also couldn't stomach betrayal. Wait, that's what you think? I betrayed you? Worse. Lots. You betrayed yourself. What do you mean by that? Biochip did more than just blend our memories. That line that kept V and Silverhand separate, well, faded a while back. I'm still here. I know what I want, and I know where I came from. I, I, I. Who's this I? You even know? Same V who was left to die in that landfill. Nothing's changed. And your will to fight? To tell Death to go fuck himself? Where's that come from? Always had that. That's who I am. How can you be so sure? I mean, when you reach back, how can you be sure whose memories you're dipping into? We're a tangled web, you and me. One in the same. So if you're here to tell me something, it's because you need to hear it yourself. You want to part ways on good terms, Johnny. As friends. Not sure that's possible anymore. Listen. I'm on an operating table getting sliced open. Our socket docks are taking the chip out as we speak. I mean, you knew it'd end this way. That the day would come when I'd want to be normal again. Want my life back. Normal's overrated. If it exists at all, they're cutting a piece of us out. And that'll leave a hole forever. That was the deal we made. I'd stay, you'd go. Deal was to fight side by side, have each other's backs. And we did that, we won. Better to die on your feet than live on your knees. You sold a part of yourself, of us, to a mega corp. Was it really worth it? If you're all paranoid about being thrown in another Arasaka prison, don't be. They're gonna shred you. You're never gonna get it. It's not about Arasaka. Not even about life and death. Then what's it all about, Johnny? Enlighten me. The principle, V. It's always about the principle. Swap meat for chrome, live a BD fantasy, whatever. But at the end of it all, it's the code you live by that defines who you are. Ever get lost? It shows you the way home. Bust up into pieces? It puts you back together again. That rocker boy Silverhand's credo? Words he lived by? Something Johnny picked up from V. The old V. Conversation's pointless. Goodbye, Johnny. Remember what Dex asked you? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Sure, I remember. Shame you chose wrong. Damn shame.
In addition, numerous brain functions remain dormant. The neural impulses have been rerouted to the neural processor, a temporary measure. When can I expect a full report? I will send it by the end of this week. My congratulations again on your success. Goodbye. Please prepare the patient's room. Where's... what? Where's Johnny? The construct has been cleared from all engrams. The madness is past. So... We shredded him, as agreed. I'm... I'm hearing... purple. What, what the... The synesthesia is temporary. We had to create additional synapses in your brain. I think I'm gonna be sick. Having... trouble remembering... how I got here. Some memories you have lost permanently. Others will return in time. You must stay calm. Your neural processor is overburdened. Any unnecessary stress response will only make things worse. Um, am I still V? I, I died. Twice, I... Everything is in order. No. I... Who am I? Please take the patient away. Notepad. Progression and its further trajectory remain unclear. Removing the tumors proved a difficult task. But the operation on the engram was the real challenge. Let's go. Is the ship of Theseus, dismantled into component parts and reassembled, um. Please take the patient away. Is the ship of Theseus, dismantled into component parts and reassembled, still the same ship? We are pioneers, the first to ever separate mentally conjoined twins. Yes. When you killed In the end, even the human soul can go under. I hear the cuckoo call. End of note. And long for Kyoto. Huh? Please rest. A doctor will be with you shortly. Come here. Waiting for you. was reported dead months ago, but now it's been revealed that a copy of his consciousness was made before his death. It appears his consciousness was used to override that of his son and heir, Yorunobu Arasaka. This shocking development was revealed at a press conference earlier today. Minasan, Sofu yoku. Kare ochita hana wa eda ni modoranai to itte imashita. 
人は誰も物心ついた瞬間から死を恐れるものですついに人類最大の恐怖が克服されました私サブロー・アラサカは今息子の体を使い皆さんの前に立っています私はかつて頼信に生を与えました彼は愛する父のためにそれを返してくれたのです私のいない間頼信は会社を変革しようといくつかの決定を下しましたがこれは過ちでした私の指揮のもと荒坂社は元の姿を取り戻します決して揺らぐことのない強い荒坂が帰ってくることを約束いたしますご清聴ありがとうございました Today is truly a historic day. Today, technology has fulfilled the promise left empty by religion. Saburo Sama, Makoto ni Omedate. Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. No, good morning. No, got some good news for you. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. Parietal lobe examination. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. And it was a sight to behold, he said. How a soul would choose its life. Sometimes pitiable, sometimes laughable, at times wonderful and strange. That's enough. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Please link yourself to the device. Higher order representation formation initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. What's this thing in a jig for? It measures pupillary response. Higher order representation what? Engram surgery carries an elevated risk of the onset of personality disorder. The test is essential. What are these tests meant to test? Initiate device calibration. Respond to the keywords. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Journey. Freedom. Home. The city. Enemy. Arasaka. Principal. Rebellion. Betrayal. Johnny. You're in a cornfield. Tall, green plants, as far as the eye can see. The sun is bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. What's this test for anyway? It tests your level of empathy. The heat has made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine has torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. 
your mouth begins to water. What's wrong with me? A shadow gradually falls over the ground, the first rain cloud of the year. Hmm, yes, right. Measurements complete. How'd I do? We will see. Motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Please connect to the device. What's this test all about? Please walk. Gradually accelerate. What's this supposed to prove? I already know I can walk. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. How am I doing? Please control your breathing. Accelerate by three. Shit. Get up. You can't stay here. Welcome to N54 News. I'm Jillian Jordan. The world remains gripped by the revelation that Saburo Arasaka has returned from the dead in the body of his son, Yorinobu Arasaka. A letter of protest regarding the apparent resurrection has been signed by religious leaders, human rights groups, and Virtue 100 company CEOs. This is an abomination born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Suburo Arasaka's seizure of power is in violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor? Not only their livelihoods, but even their bu- You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! Life is not for trade! Life is not- But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite. Gaibu no katagata ni toyakaku iwareru sujiai wa arimasen.性を受けることに許可が必要ない以上、蘇ることも同様であると考えるべきです。私が息子を殺めたなどという主張は事実無根。大的根拠もありません。合意の上での身体の譲与は一種の寄付に分類することができ、殺人には到底与えしません。殺
Next test, please connect your personal link. Higher order representation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. Why can't I solve the fucking cube? That is what I'm trying to determine. Same thing. Again? We need very precise data. Let's start this thing. Device calibration. Please respond to each keyword with your initial association. As quick as I can, no thinking, got it. Illness. Me. Rebellion. Death. I, me. Johnny. The present. Hell. The future. No idea. You're in a cornfield. Tall green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is in your eyes, bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. The heat's made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine is torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. The shadow gradually covers the ground, the first rain cloud of the year. Measurements complete. We will now move on to the motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Personal link. Really aced it last time, didn't I? Slow walk. Not bad so far, huh? Try a little faster. Accelerate by three. I... I can't. Gotta stop. Testing concluded for today. Communications have been unlocked. You may now phone home. Earth. Hey. You've got some nerve! Wait, what? What's the problem? I spoke with Victor, so please stop acting surprised. Where the hell are you? Hey, stop yelling at me. You piece of shit! You're lucky we're not face to face! Seriously, where are you? Sitting on an Arasaka orbital station. No idea which one. My guy could give a shit which one! You're in trouble! Again! Alone! You could have asked for help. Had my reasons. Oh, fuck! Enough! Just stop pissing me off! Return to Earth, now, before they hurt you. Nice to hear your voice again. It's good to hear yours too, idiot. Now come home. This is Judy. Sorry, can't answer because I'm busy packing my shit. If you don't know why, it means I just didn't want to tell you. If this is V, I'll call you. Maybe, baby, when I'm done being pissed off. Hey, how's it going? 
watching the Little Big Corporate season finale. You? Got rid of the biochip. No. You're fucking kidding. Got a big old hole in my head. They filled it with... I don't know... Cables and shit. Where are you? Which hospital? Dunno. Orbital station. Arisaka. All right. All right. Don't worry about a thing. Honest? I think I might be losing my mind here. You there alone? No, there's some doctor here. Real bitch. But I guess that's it. So yeah, pretty much alone. You shouldn't be. Not now. It's not good. How'd little big corpo rats turn out? Oh, not about to spoil it for you. You can catch the reruns when you get back. You watch it again with me? <laughs> Will I? I'm so glad I've got you. B. You are the best thing this planet's got going for her. So come back down. Wish I were there with you now. Okay. I'm gonna hang up now, make a few calls, get you back to Night City. Sound good? Take care, B. See you soon. Hey. Hey, uh, bad time. Can I wait? Um, not really. It's actually important. Fuck. Sorry. Look, can't talk now. Gonna have to call you back. How's it going? Hey, think I ought to ask you the same. How's Misty? Well, after you left, she went off to visit her folks. For a while, most likely. Got a postcard from her, from Warsaw. There's a polar bear on it. Tell her I said hi when she gets back. You'll tell her yourself. Got rid of the biochip. Arasaka do it? Yeah. Sitting on their orbital station. All right. So once you get back, pay me a visit, huh? You're gonna need a thorough checkup. Yeah, so, to be honest, been better. What am I supposed to do long distance over the phone? I just wanted to talk, Vic. <sighs> Look, we go back long enough that you know I'm no good at this stuff. And Misty's out of town. What am I supposed to do? Get a grip. Make a decision. You already showed yourself and me. You can do it. Yeah. Thanks for the pep talk, Vic. Sounds like a plan.
Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. of tensions was heightened when your noble Arasaka assumed leadership following his father's death and accused Militech of his murder. However, in an unexpected shift, the return of Saburo Arasaka appears to have diffused the situation between the rival megacorporations. Saburo Arasaka and NUS President Rosalind Myers have agreed to meet in person to lay the groundwork for a lasting peace. A first step of goodwill was taken today as the Arasaka CEO withdrew from Night City 15 armored vehicles from the company. Hey, listen. These tests are gonna go on much longer. We need very precise data. Can't stand this anymore. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Place it up. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. No. Want to talk to Hanako Arasaka? Please respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Enough! No more tests. I refuse to take any. Please step onto the treadmill. As quickly as you can, without thinking about it. V. No. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Fuck, no, enough. I've had it, fucking hate this place. Mora, what are you doing here? I have come to speak with you. It is an awful place. It is no wonder you are losing your mind. 
Come all the way here to take me home? They asked me to speak with you. What are you gonna do now? Still aim to protect Saburo's ass? I have been transferred to Japan. I will fly from here to Takamatsu. Why? New times, new duties. But we say far too much about me. So Saburo Arasaka's back, and Yorinobu's body. Yes, justice has been done. So, got your revenge? Feel satisfied? I believe Hanako Arasaka chose the best solution. Saburo should have stayed dead. Many wish him dead, but he will survive them all. Sorry. Guess I'll never understand what you see in the guy. You did not spend your life at his side and... Well, I did not come here to talk about the Arasakas. Fine. So what is it you gotta tell me? I am sorry to say it is not good. I will be blunt. The surgery did not help. You will be dead before winter. Fuck! You must accept the truth, then listen to what I say. There are options. Said Arasaka would fix me if I helped you. You promised. I believe truly they could. Said you had powerful friends. Where are those friends now? I did not come with empty hands. We must speak about your options. Hanako Arasaka promised to save my life. It is the reason she sent me here. To discuss the alternative. Dead in a few months. That's me, huh? You will feel better at first, but then the illness will grow fierce, attacking full force. Your final weeks, you will spend in bed. Fuck! Please, feel no anger. I wish to speak about an alternative. What are you talking about? Trusted you all once already. You let me down. You may join the Secure Your Soul program. Hanako Arasaka has agreed to it. You will leave your body. Arasaka will store your engram in Mikoshi until a way is found to transfer it to a new body. Store? Can I get a new body right off? With technology as it is now, this is impossible. Seemed pretty damn possible for Saburo Arasaka. He returned in his son's body. Tissue compatibility made things easier. Yet your phenotype, thanks to the chip, is unique. Arasaka cannot provide a suitable body at this time. Sorry. Not buying it. Arasaka's out to lock me up. You overstate your importance. To the Arasakas, I fear you are nobody. War nobody. With this offer, Hanako Arasaka rewards you generously for your service. There's not, as you say, more to the story. Nope. Doesn't sound good at all to me. I agree to this, and they'll do whatever they want with me. There will be a contract to protect you. Sign it, and you will live. It is written here that you relinquish all rights, but do not worry. The law is simply behind the times, and Ingram is not legally a person. So I get to be corporate property first. Like many brain dance stars and politicians from what I know, the program is a success. There have been no complaints. And if I say no? This is not a prison. You will take your things and return to Night City. Why are you? I would sign, but the choice is yours. Think it through carefully. Made my decision. Going back to Worth. Going home.
You will die, dear. You're all right, Takamura. I like you. Thanks for coming all the way up here to help. But one thing you never understood, and never will. What is that? Got no idea how sweet it is to be free. You speak out of bitterness. Please reconsider. No. This here's goodbye. But I'm not gonna forget you. What we did together. Goodbye, B. How's the Earth looking from way up there? She is pretty as they say? Or is that just another lie? Listen, don't forget, your implants were made for Earth gravity. Could start acting up in orbit. What I'm trying to say is, don't ignore any error warnings, okay? And when you're back, I mean, if you come back, I'll do a full checkup. Maybe even give you a little discount. Take care, V. Hey, V. Everyone's telling me you're a, a base gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. Who you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you. There's always food on my table. Me casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, Vi. Hey, V. Long time no see. Let me guess, you still the top of your game in all of Night City? <laughs> yeah, I left all that. I guess I'm just calling to say thanks. For everything. It wasn't until I'd left everything behind that I realized how depressed I was for all that time. Take it from me, V. If you ever get the chance, just leave. Leave and don't look back. The weight it takes off your shoulders, I... 
I can't even describe it. All right, enough lecturing. Take it easy, man. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, V, so funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake, voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously, I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, and uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you can. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out. B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. But I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hello, V. From what I understand, you have less than six months to live. I do not know how you plan to spend this time. Perhaps you have chosen to put your feet up, rest, ponder life's meaning. Or perhaps you continue to do what you are good at. If that is the case, my father and I would gladly retain your services. You would be compensated generously. Six months will pass faster than you imagine. It would be a shame to let this time go to waste.
Hey, it's Peralez. V, you're gonna want to hear this. But first, you need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab. And they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when you get a sec, call me, okay? Oh, oh yeah, and don't forget to delete this message. Hey V, orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The Fool, the Moon, the High Priestess. Those, uh, those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. Cause we lost everything.